What is up guys and welcome back to another episode of Assassin's Creed 2. So as you can see here, I am wearing the black armor. So this is Altair's armor, I finally unlocked it. And the reason I didn't show you guys that was because I just discovered that these missions that we're doing now, so originally when the game came out, back in I think it was 2009, um, there was 11 sequences and then there was a jump. So it would go from 11 to 14. 12 and 13 glitched so these are actual dlc that is included now with the Ezio collection so i thought because i'm already dumping time towards that i would get the armor ready so that you guys can see it in its form for a few episodes so this is altair's armor it looks badass and i also got his sword so this thing cost me 46 grand it is the best sword in the game that i know of so with that, it's time to get in there and finish the last mission of sequence 12. I also went ahead and, oh, don't mind these guys here. You guys could just stop there. Um, I needed them for other purposes. So this is the final mission of sequence 12. I also collected all the codex pages, so we have those for sequence 14 when the time comes. Far from the tree. Search the abbey located in the Romania wetlands for the black robe monk who stole the apple of Eden. So this gives us, you know, a little bit more in the story. So all DLC and things like that, if I can, I am going to complete it. So let's go. So we're looking for this monk, two-timey son of a gun. Ah, oh, monks were nice people. I'm gonna collect this chest for no apparent reason. Like, I don't need the money, you know? But I'm gonna do it anyway because. Oh. Easy there, buddy. Mother son, the mother of a puta. Blessings on your brother. Grazie. I wonder if you can help me. What do you see? A monk in black robes, who lacks one of his ten fingers. Well, Brother Guido has only nine toes. You sure it wasn't a toe? <laughs> Quite sure. And then there's Brother Domenico, but it's his entire left arm he's lacking. Again, quite sure it was a finger. Hmm. Now wait a moment. I do recall a black-robed monk with nine fingers. Yes, of course. When we had our last San Vincenzo's feast at the Abbey. Yes, I know the place. I'll try there. Grazie. Go in peace, brother. I always do. All right, so we got to get out of here without being spotted. Thanks, brother Ocalan. Yeah, this armor is so sick. And the sword is killing, like, the big dudes in two strikes. It's pretty badass. Like all the money in the game with the DLC and everything, you uh, you know, you need all that money to be buying all the paintings and all that, all that nonsense, you know. I'm just interested in knowing how the hell I'm gonna get back into this place. Might have to actually. Oh, 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 okay. All right, guess we're going for a swim. Maybe I can duck under this gate here. Yes, I can. So I don't even want to look, you know, anymore for posters or nothing. I'm just paying these dudes off. I'll show you guys a little neat secret here. So you do that, you pay him, and then he just rob his ass. Okay, so, um, nobody had to see that. So, you do get a little bit of uh, the bar fill again on the notoriety, but it is like cut in half, so, yeah. A little food for thought. 
So this game doesn't have too much left. Excuse me, brother. I wonder if you can... <laughs> Unholy demon! Get away! What's wrong? You're the one who killed Brother Stefano! Brothers, the killer of monks has returned! That's fast. Please, no, I don't want to die. I only kill those who kill others. And your brother Stefano was a killer. I'm sure you are no such thing. Now, listen to me. I'm looking for a black robed monk who's missing a finger. Missing a finger, you say? Do you mean like Fra Savonarola? Savonarola? Who is this? You know him? I did. He was one of us for a time. And then? We suggested he retire to a hermitage for a good long time. I'm afraid to say his retreat has come to an end. Where would he have gone? Oh dear. Santo Spirito? In Firenze? It's where he studied. Perhaps it's where he would return. I thank you. Go with God, brother. So that's pretty much it for this sequence. So we got one more sequence. Um, apparently it isn't too long either. It's a lot of like mini missions. It's DLC. It's never going to be as crazy as, you know, the regular campaign. But I thought if it's in the game, why the hell would I not do it, right? So we can... Look at this armor again. This thing is hey, badass. Desmond, I think I repaired that busted memory. Why don't you try opening it? We jump straight into the next one. That's why the computer guy Sean said that the Pope, uh, that Borgia became Pope in 92, but then when there was a time sequence jump, I was like, what the hell? It's still in the same year. We're supposed to jump in four years, right? So, we've actually jumped quite a few years in this one. Florentine Fiasco. Meet up with Machiavelli in the Alterno District of Florence. Alterano District, sorry. If Piero had only a tenth of his father's talent, we'd still have some place to call home. Okay, I'm completely notorious. Love it. Guess I'm showing you guys the sword. If you're not gonna grab me, then I'll just rip your shit apart. So DLCs, they always tend to say they're repetitive, yada yada yada, you know? But, I like it, it fills the story. I don't think I've ever played these, I, I don't know, I don't remember. None of this is coming back to me. Maybe because I finished it so quickly. I just threw us out. Said all we own belong to the kids of the San Marco now. I don't really want to fight these guys. I just want to get across. Priority is just to rip the sequence apart in this episode. Hey, Machiavel! Salve, Ezio. You picked a fine time for a homecoming. Then it's true. Savonarola has taken control of Firenze. Yes. 
No doubt aided by that treacherous artifact. We should get to work on retrieving it. That may be more complicated than you think. <laughs> when isn't it? Why don't you fill me in on things? <laughs> Walk with me. It all started a few weeks ago. The man everyone once reviled was suddenly the one they worshipped. Ah, the apple. Only in part. It's not the city he's in from, but its leaders. Men possessed of influence and power. They, in turn, oppress the citizens and ensure his will is done. The people act as if they have no say in the matter. Rare is the man willing to oppose the status quo. And so it falls to us to help them see the truth. Those bodies bear the emblem of the Borgia. Mm. Yes. The Spaniard keeps sending his soldiers into Firenze. And Firenze keeps sending them back. Usually in pieces. Then he knows the apple is here as well. An unfortunate complication. Andiamo. Alright, so we're escorting the man. I think... Yeah, I was gonna say, it's gonna be impossible not to fight people here. Oh, the sword is not killing as quickly as it was. It definitely is killing quicker, though, but... Still the best sword of the game, no doubt. So I polished up my armor. As you can see, the health bar is enormous. The fuck, the fuck are you looking at? There's no way I could have outrun these guys anyway. This is nice, man. Take it, buddy. Alright, done. The director assault will be dangerous. True. But what other option is there? Aside from the city leaders, the people's minds are their own, correct? See. Si. And they follow Savonarola not by choice, but force and fear? See. Si. Then I propose we use this to our advantage. If we can silence his lieutenants and stir up discontent, he will be distracted, and I will have a chance to strike. Clever. I'll speak with La Volpe and Paola. They can help to organize the uprising as you free the districts. Then it's settled. I'll take care of his abettors. So that's pretty much what this is. It's, you know, killing a select people and, yeah, that many people. Um, and then, yeah, and then going after him. It's simply assassination. So, as you can see, we have... Oh, what's going on here? We have quite a few guys to kill and that's pretty much the memory so let's make it happen we'll start off with the one nearest to us at least now we're incognito we can move freely jump up come on oh okay you 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 you, you. Uh, Assassin's Creed, you definitely have your moments. You just, you just call me a peasant? Okay, first of all, that's rude, man. Like, that's rude. How can I not climb this stupid thing? Here we go. Reject the base and material. Seek salvation in the flames. So it's simply kill the guy and run away. Kill the guy, run away. Still life. Assassinate the beguiled artist. It would be my pleasure. Oh, 
became a painter. I did so as a means to express my devotion to God. Here there was an opportunity to grow closer to him. For if divinity was perfection, then surely capturing it would be divine. It seemed a righteous one. A form of prayer. Yes. What have I done? What have I done? Your actions were not your own. But they were. My own self-doubt let him hold me as he did. I am sorry. So in a sense, as am I. we're almost... Non è una scelta che compio a cuor leggero. Requiescat in pace. So in a sense, killing them is also saving them because they're not corrupted anymore, right? You are not going anywhere! On him! Okay, let's get the hell out of here. Climb up here. Wonder if the notoriety will disappear yet. Another brotherhood will stir up the pot in the area that I've cleaned up. Beautiful. Alright, we move on to the next mission. And that's it, guys. That's literally what the sequence is going to be. It's going to be a cleanup. I really get spotted? No. Nah. People of Firenze, come, gather round. Listen well to what I say. The end approaches. Now is the time to repent, to beg God's forgiveness. Doomsday, stop the preacher's corrupt sermon. Don't you see? The signs are all around us. And he's surrounded. Come, deceive. <laughs> Darkness. We must stand firm in our devotion, lest they consume us all. Oh, that you think me mad. How would I even get close to this dude without? Know that I too once shared your answer, your fears. That was before Sonoroma. Oh man, that's a lot of dudes. Come here, prick. Yes, I'm with you. No. You know what to do. Stay calm. No. This guy's pissing me off already. Come here. Oh, I got you now. You save another one. Your mind, since it is your own. <laughs> Not all of us require deception to be convinced. I already believed. All I said is true. Mm. Nothing is true. Non è un compito facile il mio. So goes to show this guy was a nutcase. Pace. Now we just gotta flee the 3,000 men that are chasing us. Love it. 3,004. 3,006. Pizza the merda. Who are you calling a piece of poop? Huh? I don't want to use a springboard.
Tanrı Dani. Alright, and they continue to clear out. There's one more here. There's a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven more. A lot of people to kill, jeez. Alright guys, so if you like what you see, you like the new piece of armor, you like just hanging out with your boy Sabres, don't forget to hit that like button. If you're new to the channel, maybe hit that subscribe button. And ring the bell for notifications. Even if you're already subscribed, maybe hit the bell. You know, you want to know, instead of having to go into YouTube and finding out if I've posted anything, hitting the bell, you'll know that I'm doing it. I'll send you a notification. Non si passa. Do you hear me? Until you've all submitted and given yourself over to the prophet, Savonarola, this bridge will remain close to you. Oh, nice. Arch Nemesis, eliminate the Conditore guarding the Ponte Vecchio. I hear you moaning and complaining. You say you have things to do, places to go. The only one moaning is going to be you when I slit your throat. You have but one obligation to submit. Why fight us? Why resist? This city is ours. Your precious Medici have abandoned you, led into the waste. It would be like impossible to get to this guy without getting caught. Oh, that's not the guy I wanted to get. Come here. Prick. Pricky bastard. You were a noble's clothes. How is it Savonarola charmed you? Wealth and power do not ensure contentment. I wanted even more. And now instead, you have nothing. Questo non è che un atto dovuto. Requiescat in pace. You told him, man. <laughs> so we just gotta return to Anonymous. I wonder how long Ed Ezio can hold his breath. Oh, love it. We're just gonna swim away to freedom. That's a good thing, the enemies can't swim, so. That's what it is, it's, it's, you know, it's really quick missions. You can almost see the repetition, but I get to play it more as SEO. For you guys, <laughs> why the hell not? You know what I mean, some people don't, can't afford the DLC. Some people never got around to it. Some people played it and want to see it again. They want to see their boy Sabres doing it. You know? I'm here for you guys. So, we're doing them. We're going to do all of it. Every DLC in every game. Okay, so. The nearest. <laughs> Let's do this one. Hopefully this doesn't turn into a really lengthy episode, because I really did want to finish this sequence in this episode, so... How bizarre, yeah. Secure those crates. We can ill afford to let their contents fall into the wrong hands. 
Port Authority, board the ship without being seen and put an end to the merchant's trading days. Man, he can't be seen. Suck the side of To kill the target without being detected. This one will be interesting. How the hell am I going to kill this guy? I think there's another dude that walks this way. Yeah, he's coming now. Let's uh, go back down. I think the best way to do it is to clean up the back deck here. See another dude. Oh shit. Fuck. I see another guy. There's a dude over there. He keeps walking back and forth. Now the other dude's walking back. Hmm. Give them my patrons. But that was before they brought it. Opened my eyes. Oh, I did it. Sweet. Master Assassin. What? What have I done? You tried to force devotion. Sometimes the people must be told. What do you think? No good has ever come of that. Benché il mio cuore sia turbato, la mia mente è lucida. Requiescat in pace. Oh God. Whoa, 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 easy, easy. After him. Let's get the hell out of here. Man, they're going to be able to see me from here, though. Yep. Okay. It bloody worked. It bloody goddamn worked. I like that at least you go back to uh, being anonymous again. Was there a doctor here? Perfect. Can uh, buy all my supplies here. Thank you very much, sir. I'll be on my way. Wow, 43 grand. While this loads up, I'm gonna turn on my fan. Keep watch over these fields. And ensure no harm comes to the bundles of fiendo. It may seem a mundane task, but it is critical nonetheless. Hitting the hay. Assassinate the farmer. But avoid alerting his henchmen. Without this most basic resource. So we gotta kill this sack of shit. Without anybody noticing again. Require clothes, food, shelter, warmth, and all 
Oh yeah, I totally fucked up. Oh well, I went stupid. I thought because I saw the red bar, I just assumed I could stand there, but I didn't even pay attention that I was in full notoriety. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna try to see his path. I think that'll be the best bet. Kill this sack of shit so we can be on the roof freely. See his path. You don't believe me, do you? Let me explain. The Fieno feeds our horses. They, in turn, pull our carts, which transport our goods to other cities where trade is conducted. In this way, our economy is made to thrive. And then there is the livestock. Cattle and sheep require Fieno for sustenance. And as you know, they provide us with all manner of things. Wool, meat, and milk, to name a few. See a bale of hay. Yeah, he walked right by it. Okay. So do not dismiss the work you do here. It is vital to our continued success. No, 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 no. Don't get caught. Don't get caught. That's you, please. Okay, so I can't make it to that bale of hay. Shit. I'm gonna take a hit here. Hmm, this is, uh... Quite interesting. Oh, I got caught. Son of a bitch. Hmm. How am I going to get to this guy? That's what I didn't do. He's going to come by this hay, and I got here nice and early. We just wait, guys. We just chill in the hay. You know what I mean? Have a hay day. <laughs> Already, many have fallen into line. They require clothing, food, shelter, and all of these things are born of death. Now we just gotta wait. Now he's walking the other way. I thought he came this way. Let's see, if he doesn't come back. Yeah, he's walking all the way down there. Right by here. Yes. Yes. You don't believe me, do you? Let me explain. The Fieno feeds our horses. They, in turn, pull our carts, which transport our goods to other cities oh, shit. where trade is conducted. In this so this is not a good day, Hill. <laughs> is made to thrive. And then there is the livestock. Cattle and sheep require Fieno for sustenance. And as you know, they provide us with all manner of things. Wool, meat, and milk. Worked out in the end anyway, so. You would have let your own people starve. And for what? Too long I suffered their insults. They called me simple and low class. 
I wanted their respect. I'm afraid you do not have mine. Per quanto sia penoso il trapasso, lieto sarà il tuo sonno. Requiescat in pace. <coughs> Okay. We finish, what is that, fifth, where we've re reached halfway of cleaning up all these sacks of shit. Keep running here. Yep. Here comes the Volpe. His beautiful brown attire. His flowing, glowing robes. Alright, so we got one up here. Yeah, so that's the halfway point of killing all these dudes. I think halfway point is a good cutoff point. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for tuning in to this episode. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. I decided that we're just gonna cut it. Don't wanna make them too long. So we will finish up this sequence in the next one. Sabers out. Peace.